Hey guys, I'm shaking. This video is going to be a little difficult for me to make. I never thought in a million years that I would be sitting here making a YouTube video and exposing Charles. I need a tissue. I'm just kidding. What's good guys? Welcome back to Charles and Alyssa forever. Guys, I know you missed that because I missed that. Me too. Yes, you know what I'm saying? Too. Going back old school. Just a little bit. A little bit. Yeah. We're about to do a Q&A. Well, Charles is going to be doing a Q&A. I have questions I'm about to ask him. And they're questions I've never asked him before. Okay. Please answer, truthfully. I'm, what, what, I'm a lie? I don't know. Or you might be like, yeah, you might lie. No, like the thing is, y'all know me. I keep it a hundred. All the time. But you might like lie to make me feel better. <laughs> <laughs> I won't get mad at you. Okay, the truth, nothing but the whole truth. Let's get it. I'm okay. Right. I'm actually kind of nervous. My phone though. is scared. Okay. Whew. I just got light headed. Okay. Have you ever worried that I would be unfaithful to you? Um. In the beginning. Why? Because I don't. You know, in the beginning, I don't trust nobody. And then I had people cheat on me before, so it's like, I, in, my, in my hearts of hearts, I'm like, dang, I know she probably won't, but at the same time, I was kind of, you know? Mm -hmm. Think about your impression of me when we first met. What had changed since then? I'm a little nervous for this. Okay, one. so when we first <laughs> met, you were very sweet, chill. Well, you were more outgoing and like stuff like that. Now, as like time went on, you're very like not sweet. No, you're still sweet. You're just more reserved and not like wild. Why you're not as wild, but you're a little wild, but you're not wild. So you want wild Alyssa back? No, I don't want wild Alyssa back. I'm saying I don't think you really liked wild Alyssa, but no, I want back. No, wild Alyssa <laughs> is, is 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 cool. It's, you know what I'm saying? I want cool Alyssa. Okay. So you're cool, but it's like sometimes it's like relax, like. Just do it. Yeah, I'm more of like mom. Yeah, when you, no. when you shouldn't be. What? Yeah, just, just you know. I what? feel like in the beginning of a relationship, you wanted me to be more like, okay, be a wife. Like, be no, I wanted show. you to be more. I wanted so I wanted you to be <laughs> not as wild because I'm like, okay, we're in a relationship. Like, let's be smart about certain stuff. Yeah. But it's like now, it's like I'm boring. No, nah, you're not boring. <laughs> That's at what all. you're saying. No, it's like now, it's like, no, now it's like, okay, we worked hard to get to a certain point. Yeah. We're able to be free a little bit. Let's be freer a little bit. Okay, so you want me to be more free? A little bit more free, carefree. Who cares, you know? Okay. Who cares? Do you like spending time with my family and friends? Um, like, so her dad's been in our house, and honestly, like, I enjoy spending time with him. Like, he's actually cool as hell. Like, your mom is cool as hell when she's not, like, in her feelings. Like, my I- mom's a little crybaby. So her mom's just a crybaby. Like, Alyssa's a crybaby, but her mom is, like, a big crybaby. So it's like, two I have to babies. comfort two crybabies <laughs> when something happens. Mm-hmm. Okay, this is a good one. I'm really curious about this one. Oh god. If we were doing role play, okay. who would you want to dress up as? I <laughs> would like to do like like a Boston secretary. Like how like when you when you came in there with that outfit and said, You need anything, boss? I was like Oh, you like that? Yeah, that was actually sexy. And like you have a wife and you cheat on your wife? No, nah, I don't, don't want to be cheating on my wife, I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> You're so stupid. <laughs> What is stopping you from proposing to me now? What's stopping me? Okay, yeah. so there's nothing that's stopping me, okay? I always say that like, me timing is everything. So um, what made you not do it like, between one and two years, or two to three, or three? Okay, so like between one, you? because so, so, like I told you, when I, when I first met Alyssa, yeah, I didn't know what marriage and stuff really is because I don't really, like, I've never seen a happy one. Yeah. But I knew that I wanted to marry Alyssa from the day that I met her, right? But, Financially, I'm smart. I'm like, there's no way that I I don't believe in like I want to get her the best. Mm -hmm. So like, and, and until I'm ready to get her the best, then there ain't no oh let's get married just to do it because I want to get you a ring. No, like, so that's what I feel like what's kept me from not doing it. And then financially, I just wanted to make sure I made the right decision. I mean, I could have made it, you know, before, but I feel like we've been going through stuff. And it's like, it's still been like underlining issues that we've always had. You have to figure, really figure it out before you make that big, yeah. big commitment. Like yeah. we're committed, yeah. but you, yeah, we really gotta. Like now I feel like 
I do today. Like we work so like we work so well together and this is not even about this this shit is not work. I'm talking about like us in general, like life. Yeah. We work so well together and we have the best moments and we are a great relate oh. we are a great couple. Yeah. And we had to go through that little bullshit to make sure that we can get to this because I honestly feel like I'll propose today if I could. Okay. Well, if I if I wanted to, obviously I can. But, <laughs> you know, but like, <laughs> you know. Okay, okay, that was a good that was a good answer. If you had to get back together with any ex, who would it be? Um, like you have to get back with one of them. So I have to choose one. You got to choose one. You don't gotta say names or anything, but you could just be like the second one, the fourth one. I'm grown now, and I don't want to give no type of to no exes. Okay. I would honestly, I wouldn't date an ex. If it wasn't for me, do you think you'd have a girlfriend right now? Right in this moment, you're 30 years old. If I wasn't here, would you have a girlfriend? Yeah, 100%. I, I would have a girlfriend. <laughs> I wouldn't be single for, I, I was single for two years before I met you. So I wouldn't be single for six, that's to make six years. I would be single. You're saying if I've never met you. Mm -hmm, I would be single because you're the best. You saying that, time out. You're saying, okay. I have not found anyone like you yet. Yeah, well, of course, I, I haven't found anyone. That's why I date you, but I'm saying. I'm settling now. <laughs> I'm not settling, no. I, you are the best, that's why I want you. But I'm saying, <laughs> let's be real and honest. Well, you, and so you'd have, a, you probably would, yeah. You probably I'll be dating anything. around. I don't know if I'll be in a committed, full-blown relationship, because I don't know where I'll be in life. If I don't have a plan, I ain't about to date. Okay. You know, if I'm not re mentally ready, Am I ready to, to give somebody my all? I was mentally ready for you. I loved you. I love you. I loved you too. I said I loved you. I love that's you why too. I dated you. I know, you. I know. And I love you. That's I why know, I I'm just you. giving you a hard time. Can you answer this question honestly? Because you never have. I have you've answered always, no question. You've always, no, this question I'm about to ask you, always taking a shot to this. Okay. When asked on truth or drinks. Okay, let's go. What is your body count? 1,000. 1,000. My body count? I don't, dude, I'm it's a- It's that much that you no, don't know? Listen, it's not that much. So- I'm 30 years old. One through 10, more than that? Probably about 10. 10 through 20. It's more probably about 10 through 20. I, I am very particular. That's actually, I'm impressed with that number. Good job. Yeah. I'm proud of you. I think that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Is Alyssa the same with Kim? Uh, for the most part, yeah. If you're honest, you, you show that on camera. You're funny. Mm -hmm. We have funny ass moments. But you are a little nicer on camera than you are <laughs> off camera. Oh, of course he's gonna say a lot. People be thinking that they can just like jump in your DM and like just get like a Hey! <laughs> like let's go out to lunch. Okay, this is a I wanna know the answer to this question. Okay. Do you like how I dress? Um, sometimes. Sometimes I don't, honestly. I like in the beginning of the relationship, you were a little bit more edgy with your outfits. The bigger you got, yeah. the less you want to be more edgy. People would steal, like listen, people would steal her outfits, post her shit, and make her delete her shit. Yeah. She I think just, I just lost my confidence in the dressing game. Yeah, like, cause she, but that's because you not like, you not like a whole designer whore. So it's yeah, like, that's funny. you know, like nowadays, like how like yeah. everybody's wearing all the same stuff. So it's like, you never really was like that ever. Yeah, I always wear like more affordable clothing and just try to yeah. make it look like it was something. Yeah, so like now you you it, it kind of it fucks you up because you feel like oh damn, do I gotta buy this to be like this? To look cool. Like I me, mean, you still be like, you know, you be looking good. I think you be looking good. I gotta stop overthinking. Yeah, just do what you do because you are the best. You are you do really well. Like when you're not thinking and just say fuck it, you are good. Trust Thank me. You. Name one person you would leave Alyssa for. In the whole world, like it could be Kim K. Kim K. Kish, Kim K. I'll probably leave for. I was just saying. Oh. Well, I'm, Honestly, I but I, but I really I really wouldn't leave you for Kim K. What if I date Kim K I for? Don't be a what if I date Kim K for six months? Mm -hmm. She showed me how to make a billion dollars. I come back, I repent. No, you can't because you already screwed her. So. No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't screw. Her. There's no way. Okay, so I screwed. Her. So. In six months, you're not gonna do that. Okay, so let's just say I date Kim K. <laughs> Whatever, I screwed her. But I tell you, this is not even for me. This is for us. This is what I'm thinking in my head. This is for us. But then I have to lay up with you every night and just look at you and be like, you fucking gay. But. 
Which is cool. <laughs> you, you would be like, well, like, how cool. was the house? No, but it would have been cooler. Did she stink? It would have been cooler if you did that before I dated you. Okay. But me personally, I, I really wouldn't like really want to like leave Alyssa. Like anybody. Kim K. She's like the hottest girl. But in the world, she's not the hottest to me. Who? Who else? I think hot? I think honestly, I think you like very attractive. Like when, thank you, but when, she is so fucking hot. Yeah, but she's only hot and attractive because she it, everything that makes her her. If you take you and put you, <laughs> no, I'm serious. Like if you take Alyssa and put hers in the same outfit, the same photographer, the same this, the same that, you will look way better than her. Okay, why don't you mention your mom much anymore? Cause I don't fuck my mom, honestly. If I'm just gonna be real, listen. You don't gotta go into detail. I'm not gonna go into detail. I always played it cool with my mom on my channel. And I love her because that's my mom. But would I would I be her friend if she wasn't my mom? No. Would I talk to her if she wasn't my mom? No. I don't know. She my mom just doesn't fuck me. Uh, what is the most difficult part of being faithful? Being faithful? Yeah, because some, you know, people have really <laughs> a lot of trouble with being faithful these days. The internet causes problems for people though. Mm -hmm. Because there's just so many options. You see everybody. You could date someone from freaking Europe. Yeah. And I could see what somebody right now in Spain is posting right now. Yeah. You know? So I think that's the problem for people. It's just like, there's too many options and people are not like, have eyes for one person. But I've always kind of been like really, really like good at like having eyes for the person that I'm with. Mm -hmm. Um, Have you ever been in love before Alyssa? I felt like I was in love, but I don't think I really was in love. What's the difference? I mean, you know, it's a, it's a lot different. I don't get the, the feelings, the bubble guts. You get the bubble guts with me? That's the shits. Oh. <laughs> Well, then you do. <laughs> no, I, no, I don't get that like that feeling. You know, when you like hear certain stuff, you're like, oh, dang, like I actually like fuck with her. You know, like I never really like planned out future. I never really planned out this, or I never like. I always do like, oh, this is like a one year thing, like, or this like a two year thing, or like, oh, like I'm gonna do this when I'm done with this. I literally told my ex girlfriend that I'm gonna date a girl like this uh -huh. while we were dating. So like. Oh my god. So like. Because I'm hella honest. If I want to be done, I'm going to be done. If I want to date somebody else, I'm going to be, be honest because that's really just how I've always been. Yeah. But this is my Victoria's Secret model right here. Aww. I'm short though. We well, both are. I know, but I think we'll be able to manage. <laughs> yeah, well, your dad's tall. He can, we can get his height for our kids. Let's hope. Yeah. And your brother's tall. Yeah. But I just pray our kids don't get no hype from my side because we're going to be mad. But I'm short too. I know, and I'm short. But you know, we might get us a little 5'11". We might get 5'11". We might get one. 5'11". One tall one. Yeah, I want to have a girl. Yeah. So I don't care if she's short or tall. Yeah, me neither, yeah. honestly. She has, that don't matter. No, it don't. But it's, the boy, <laughs> you come out three foot two. Oh my God, you're going to get... Ugh. Man. Everyone's gonna talk shit. I'm gonna pick on your ass. <laughs> no, I'm playing. I'm not. I'm son, future son, because listen, I know you're gonna watch this video, mom and dad. You know what I'm saying? Crazy. Like literally, like uh, I, like you're gonna man, watch you this video one day. You're gonna be like, mom and dad are so disgusting. But listen, That's son. What gonna be like. Listen, son. We all go through shit, and mom and dad is not perfect. <laughs> I want a girl so bad. Love you. Too. Well, guys, that ends today's video. I hope you enjoyed and got some. What are you looking at? That was you. Okay. Oh. Okay. My bad. And got some juicy details out of Charles. Um, we love you guys so much, and we'll see you in our next video. Adios. Adios.